<laughs> so, do you like the girl? <laughs> Mark likes a girl. With that said, it's not like we're always in the suite or always on campus. Today, uh, for lunch, we're gonna go out to a hawker center to get food together. Um, and it really goes to show how, how many things you can do here. <laughs> I can't do it! There are many opportunities to experience local cuisine. Today, we're gonna go to a hawker center on Holland Drive. There it is. Are you excited, Mark? <laughs> Are you excited, Kevin? No, I'm local. <laughs> How's the food, Mark? Good. While I was editing the videos, I realized that most of them were about food. Um, so that's just a disclaimer going on forth. You're gonna see a lot of food. I just wanna feel I just wanna feel you know it's empty. I'm So the Thai food was great, but we ran into some issues coming back because we actually split up um, in the end between a group of internationals and Singaporeans. The Singaporeans stayed uh, at the night festival a little longer while we internationals elected to come back a little earlier. Um, but because we were all internationals, we didn't really know our way back per se. So we got on the bus and we just had to kind of look around, get a feel for the area. We don't know where we're going, we're lost on the bus. We did get back in the end, but I would say that it, it was still, it was still a, a very fun journey. And the food videos really do pick up. This is tonkatsu, this is us at a, a supper place. We make our own popcorn, as shown right here. And we like to eat ramen with each other every now and then. Just the other day, the school treated us to some really, really good Thai coconut ice cream. Give some thoughts on the ice cream. I can't say anything, it's so good. And the other day, we went out together in a group of, of four to get Korean barbecue. <laughs> and just yesterday, we went over to Kaven's house. Uh, he invited us over for a nice kind of chill uh, hangout while watching the F1. Um, and our day ended with Dangmo losing 8-0 to the host Kaven in FIFA. How does it feel to be losing 8-0? <laughs> now if you watched my other video and if you also watched through this one, you would realize that I talk a lot about what happens outside of the classroom. And that's with intention because I, I find more value in when I'm evaluating a school um, to look at what happens outside of just academics. Because every school, you're going to have classes. Um, a lot of schools have the common curriculum like Yale and US. Um, but what happens outside is I think what's very special and, and for me I love being able to go around Singapore trying new food um, and going to music festivals uh, trying to go to the museum it's just a very vibrant place with uh, very vibrant people and I think that's what swayed me to to love Yale and US even more as I got to know it better 